Because if I am mad, it is mercy. May the gods pity the man who in his callousness can remain sane to the hideous end. Finally, after what felt like days to me, I reached the place where I was destined to be, even before I was born. I have other choices. I am not a puppet. I can do what I want. Howard, don't let the Alathotep confuse you. He is too dangerous. Don't heed his words. You must break the crystal to end this nightmare. Break the stone and ruin the plans of those damn monsters. The following paragraph is a small summary of published reports in newspapers and magazines about the strange occurrences at the recently discovered archaeological dig site. Although they created a shocking reaction with some small local sects, most people forgot them quickly, and a stranger statement came from police. Superintendent O'Neill explained that after the collapse of the underground city, due to the powerful earthquake that hit Ark Hammond and nearby towns about a month ago, an archaeologist found a male human corpse in previously unknown depths of the ruins. 
In the investigation, it was learned that the name of the man is Howard E. Lareed, the runaway patient of Wellsmoth Mental Institution. The explanation of how he entered the underground city, why he was there, and how he could get to places even archaeologists couldn't reach for several months is still a mystery. the path my ancestors traveled before me. I have no other choice. My destiny was determined long ago. Howard, don't let the Alathotep confuse you. He is too dangerous. Don't heed his words. You must break the crystal to end this nightmare. Break the stone and ruin the plans of those damn monsters. Damned monsters. Look who's talking. I'll show you who the real monster is. You cannot kill someone who's already dead, Howard. No, not Howard. He's gone now. 